Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> <clears throat> Something wrong here, I think. I didn't come at this gift, sir. Maybe I have a little cold today. The blessing of behind both guys. <laughs> So, first, I think this morning, uh, yesterday, we, I introduced to you a small booklet about the protection of the environment. Uh, maybe I would like to say a few things about that. Last year at Kaju Melam, uh, I had a chance to uh, say some. No? You can't hear? Hello? Last year at Kaju Malam, I had a chance to uh, give uh, some instructions, some talks about the, uh, regarding the protection of the environment. In this book, I have uh, raised five points regarding the protection of the environment in this book. First is uh, the protection of the forests and trees, plants. Second is uh, the protection of the sources of water or the rivers. Then thirdly, wildlife uh, protection. And the fourth is about the waste management, and uh, the fifth is uh, about the, the climate changes. Did 
and Hugo got to Samegi and a Nase Nase Nazelias Cashuji Cashu Nase Soyon Chiada and a Nase Didi Cashuadaji Chidu Chiada, Mongo Chiada, Tidea Tone and the Nase Sumjuru Chet Kaisen the Pelia. So we want to be a good bag in the end of the year. She now was shy on it. Oh, my, no, because you need to get my shift. She now, my book. Tona down. I said, so you don't show your eyes. She said, this is your idea. This is your idea. So, I'm going to go. For for people, for human beings, as well as for all the uh, animals, the life is the most important thing. And uh, uh, regarding this, uh, both in India and Tibet, um, I've I've said that we try to uh, all the monasteries, especially. In, in Tibet, there are generally around the monasteries, usually there are lots of uh, trees. And uh, before we understand, we knew about the uh, environmental protection. Uh, some places, uh, the, the forests were, uh, were cut, and also uh, sometimes the, the trees were sold, it seems. And now, uh, as a protection, and also to prevent uh, this, uh, we have we try to you know uh, we try to prevent the cutting of the trees around the monasteries, uh, and also uh, to plant more. Mm -hmm. Ibadi ini dicuri juga sungguh cerah. Di antara pelde, ini di kasih. Betul, sila betul. Third pole macam pole sahaja bang. Cuci ni. Tadi pole sumpah di resor. Anda ada sih di Himalaya, di Gili ayat deh. Di di itu kari sama tak kari dah cuci di di. And the Asia give me be Siamang be Tsone ke dengar ucchi ke ane Tere yu san te zule yang ngay bardong a chue Sun gyo chya kwa ane ding a chue Ka chue jo ma be chya so me tu de ane dun cha de ane Tere yu san te dure ya Bak zo Shua a de ane a chue ngon gwa chya a ta Ane da ane si Eh Eh me ne chue chung gu Cukup yang dalam tu, betul ya. Tapi na, hmm, betul kan orang cipta tu jadi cuma ini na, cuci si le ya. Jadi kanker lah semua be, eh, kalau cuci cuma si dua dia, tu cah dia orang tinja orang yang yue dia be, kamu orang cah dia orang. Nah, dah nak si, dah dah nak si, jangan le ya, mah pel tinggi, cuci mampu pun si. Kalau pel ni susu punya bini tu sangat tinggi tu le ya, kalau susu, bangsa macam apa cah dia orang. And uh, regarding the source of the water or the rivers, uh, the Tibet uh, is very important in this case. The scientists uh, these days uh, say that Tibet is the third pole. There's so much ice there that it is like the third pole. Uh, and especially the Himalayas. In the Himalayas, there are so many uh, ice and so much uh, snow. Uh, and the, the whole kind of Himalayan region in Tibet uh, is the source of water and also thereby uh, the source of life uh, for millions of people uh, throughout Asia. Uh, so therefore, it is very important uh, to 
protect these sources of water and to prevent uh, getting these waters polluted. Mm. And also, uh, him, the, the Mount Kailash is regarded as the, the beginning source of the four great rivers, mostly come to India. And then also, uh, there are many rivers from Tibet going into China. Uh, and all these rivers have become the life kind of, uh, life-giving source uh, for most of the people uh, in a very uh, big area of Asia. Mm. <laughs> Palam <laughs> Could <laughs> Marse Shasar, And about the protection of the animals, uh, a few years ago in Tibet, it was a, a custom and fashion uh, to wear uh, skins of uh, tigers and leopards and things like that as decoration. But that, uh, because of the, the, the instructions by His Holiness, uh, now, uh, there is not very many Tibetans uh, who wear this. Uh, it has become much, much less. And uh, unless uh, they are forced to wear them, uh, there is not much interest of wearing them. And I think this uh, helps a lot uh, to, uh, to prevent the extinction of these animals like the tigers, uh, and, and, and some kind of leopards in Asia. And also, uh, these things, uh, the, there's, a, there's a connection uh, with this uh, to uh, vegetarianism, uh, that uh, even if we cannot uh, completely become vegetarian, uh, it's very important that we have to be, we have to think about it. Uh, in, in connection also with the environment, because uh, when we have to rear these uh, lots of animals uh, like pigs and uh, uh, other things, other animals for, for consumption, then uh, it is also very clear that lots of natural resources have to be used uh, to feed these animals and so therefore, 
uh, it has a direct impact on the environment as well. Kini and then fourth is about the waste management. And uh, this is some kind of a uh, movement. Uh, it is found out that uh, the monasteries uh, do not have so far a very good uh, kind of training or uh, uh, culture uh, in this case of uh, waste management. So by giving uh, training and uh, um, kind of example uh, to these, uh, starting with the monasteries first, and then going into the, uh, the public, and maybe is Tibet, and then Himalayan regions, and from there, uh, all Buddhists, you know, they should uh, try to, you know, start to become an example in this case of uh, waste management. And I'm seeing you know. And I'm seeing you know, 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 and I'm seeing you だもんびがよ。で、ニュースアンティ